Rwanda is a small country in Africa that has big dreams of becoming modern and prosperous. Despite facing a tragic genocide in 1994, where a large number of people were killed, Rwanda is now focused on moving forward. The country is working on various ambitious projects, like building infrastructure and using technology to improve. In this video, we'll explore these projects that are shaping Rwanda's future. Keep in mind that despite its past challenges, Rwanda is determined to make positive changes and progress. One of the big projects in Rwanda is the Bugasura International Airport. It's a major development and is currently the largest project in the country. They're spending around $700 million on it, and it should be finished by 2024. The airport, situated near Bobusera, will be able to handle 2.5 million passengers every year. This is great news for Rwanda's tourism and business, as the airport is expected to become a key hub for international flights. It will likely attract new airlines and more tourists to Rwanda, as well as boost trade between Rwanda and neighboring areas. Interestingly, a Chinese company is building the airport and it's anticipated to create thousands of jobs during both the construction and operation phases. Bugasura International Airport takes the 13th spot on our list of Rwanda's ongoing mega-projects. The Kigali Convention Center is the biggest conference center in East Africa, ranking 12th on our list of Rwanda's major projects. It can accommodate 10,000 people and host various events like conferences, exhibits, and concerts. This center reflects Rwanda's economic success by emphasizing its commitment to organizing international events and attracting foreign investments. It also benefits tourism by drawing people from around the world, showcasing Rwanda's progress and determination to play a global role in the economy. Moving on to number 11 on the list is the Rwanda Smart City, a groundbreaking project in Kigali. It's estimated to cost $500 million and includes residential, commercial, and industrial zones. What makes this project unique is its integration of smart features such as high-speed internet, a smart grid, and a smart transportation system. This investment not only promises economic growth, but also job opportunities and an improved quality of life for Rwandans. The smart city underscores Rwanda's commitment to innovation and technology. Ranking at number 10 is the Hionzo Irrigation Project, a new initiative focused on improving agriculture in Rwanda's Kanso area. With an estimated cost of $80 million, this project aims to provide water for farming activities, ultimately increasing agricultural productivity and enhancing food security in the region. Besides boosting economic growth, the Hionzo Irrigation Project is expected to create job opportunities and contribute to regional economic development. Its success is crucial for unlocking Rwanda's agricultural potential and improving the lives of local farmers. Moving on to the ninth spot is the Nonvarongo Hydropower Project. This new hydroelectric development on the Niabarongo River is nearing completion with a total cost of $1.4 billion. Once operational, the hydropower project will not only provide energy for Rwanda, but also for neighboring countries with a capacity of 180 megawatts. This significant investment in Rwanda's energy industry is poised to drive economic growth and enhance the quality of life for its citizens. Additionally, it underscores Rwanda's commitment to renewable energy sources. Next on the list is the Gatumba Industrial Park, an emerging industrial hub in Rwanda's western region. Spanning 500 hectares, this park aims to catalyze industrial development, generate employment opportunities, and fuel economic growth in the region. It is set to accommodate various sectors, including manufacturing, processing, and assembly. The Gatumba Industrial Park strategically situates itself near Nyungwe Forest National Park and the Rwanda-Burundi border, connecting to the national highway system. This positioning makes it an attractive destination for international investments, contributing to the diversification of Rwanda's economy and fostering sustainable development. Shifting our focus, the seventh noteworthy project is the Rwanda Biomedical Center, or RBC, a state-of-the-art facility under construction in Kigali. Boasting a capacity of 500 beds, 
this biomedical institution will serve as a pivotal resource for infectious disease research and treatment, with a specific focus on combating diseases like HIV AIDS, malaria, and tuberculosis. Additionally, the RBC will house advanced research facilities and function as a regional biomedical research hub. Anticipated to be completed in 2025, this facility will significantly elevate Rwanda's health care capabilities, reinforcing its capacity to address major health challenges and positioning itself as a key center for medical advancements in the region. Turning our attention to the Rwanda Science and Technology Park, which holds the sixth position on our list and is situated in Kigali, this cutting-edge scientific and technological hub is crafted to act as a breeding ground for innovation and business. Equipped with office spaces, laboratory facilities, and other resources, the park aims to nurture technological advancements and fuel economic growth. With the capacity to house up to 1,000 people, the Rwanda Science and Technology Park is on track to become a dynamic hub of innovation, providing crucial support for enterprises in their growth and scaling endeavors. It stands as a key driver in Rwanda's journey towards evolving into a knowledge-based economy. Now, moving on to the fifth spot on our list, we have the Rwanda Fiber Optic Network. Currently being deployed across the country, this new network is geared to deliver high-speed internet access to Rwandans, fostering communication and connection. Boasting a capacity of 100 gigabytes per second, the fiber optic network is set to catalyze economic growth and development by enhancing Rwanda's digital infrastructure. Beyond that, it will bolster regional connectivity by establishing links between Rwanda and its neighboring nations. This ambitious project is poised to revolutionize communication capabilities in Rwanda, providing a substantial boost to various sectors and propelling socio-economic progress. Making our way to the fourth position on the list, we have the Rwanda National Stadium. Currently under construction in Kigali, this cutting-edge stadium is set to claim its spot as a venue for major athletic events and concerts. With a substantial capacity of 30,000 spectators, it's poised to make a significant impact on Rwanda's tourism industry. Designed to meet FIFA standards, the stadium, nearing completion, will not only host events but also feature a training area, a media center, and a museum. The Rwanda National Stadium stands as a testament to the country's dedication to sports and entertainment, offering a world-class facility for athletes, fans, and visitors alike. Now moving on to the third spot, we have the Kivu Belt Development Project, a large-scale initiative focused on unlocking the economic growth potential of the Kivu Belt region. With an estimated cost of $1 billion, this comprehensive project involves the construction of roads, railways, and power lines, along with the development of new industrial parks and tourism destinations. The Kivu Belt region is rich in natural resources, including gold, tin, and tungsten, and is home to several lakes suitable for hydroelectric power generation. By tapping into the economic potential of the region, the Kivu Belt Development Project aims to uplift the lives of its residents and drive sustainable growth. Moving to the second position on our list, we have the Gizigara Industrial Park, situated in Rwanda's Dizagara region. This upcoming industrial park is set to span 500 hectares and, like other industrial parks, is designed to promote industrial development, generate employment, and stimulate economic growth in the region. The Gizagara Industrial Park's strategic location near the Nyungwe Forest National Park and the Rwanda-Burundi border positions it as an appealing destination for various sectors, including manufacturing, food processing, and tourism. With its anticipated opening in 2024, the park is poised to significantly contribute to economic diversification and sustainable development. Claiming the top spot on our list is the Kigali Ring Road, a major infrastructure project involving the construction of a 56-kilometer ring road around the city of Kigali, featuring six lanes. The primary goal of this project is to alleviate traffic congestion within the city and enhance the movement of goods and people. By improving connectivity and accessibility, the Kigali Ring Road will fortify Kigali's integration with other parts of Rwanda, facilitate smoother transportation, and pave the way for additional economic growth and development within the country. 
these projects, from industrial development to infrastructure improvements, are not only enhancing Rwanda's economic landscape, but also creating employment opportunities and improving the overall quality of life for its citizens. Well, that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one.